This is the Intel Reader. It is a handheld device that is designed to give access to printed material. It can take a photograph of printed material using the camera here on the bottom edge. I just captured, a, uh, I captured an image. And read it out loud. Um, most readers out there are designed as a convenience for people who want to be able to read on the go. This is a necessity for people who don't have access to printed material, something that gives them independence and confidence and hopefully more success. We have voicing, so the items on the menu are library, recent items, shoot mode, settings, and help, and we can listen to them. Recent items, shoot mode, settings. Help. Alice's Adventures in Wonderland. Alice's Adventures in Wonderland uh, by Lewis Carroll. So I'll select that and then we'll have to jump back to the beginning of the book. Letters. So I was halfway through it before. Let me jump to the start. Top of document. And let's read a little. Alice's Adventures in Wonderland by Lewis Carroll One down the rabbit hole Alice was beginning to get very tired of sitting by her sister on the bank and of having nothing to do. Once I can increase that font size, book, her sister was writing, making it larger or and still larger. Again. And what is the use of a book? While you're reading, you can also um, jump by pages. Next page. Either next page. Alice. And you can look at the images that you actually that were actually this was actually generated from. I told you you can take a picture. Well, we can show you the pictures that were taken. So you can see here the full pages, pages uh, one and two here, and then you can increase that and blow it up so that you can see the pictures that were on that page. Now you can also be listening to it while you're looking at the pictures. Alice opened the door and found that it led into a small passage, not much larger than a rat hole. She knelt down and looked along the... You can change the voice speed. You can make it much faster or much slower. 250 words per minute. 250 words per minute, anyone? Let's try it. 250 words per minute. Select it. Alice's adventures in Wonderland. She could not even get her head through the doorway. And even if my head would go through, thought poor Alice, it would be of very little use without my shoulders. Oh, how I wish I could shut up like a telescope. I think I could, if I only knew how to begin. For, you see, so many out of the way things have happened lately that Alice had begun to think that very few things indeed were really impossible. The device also will play uh, MP3s, and it will even generate MP3s. It will make you your own audiobooks. So you can take a photograph of something and then create an audiobook and put it on another device. The Intel Reader has been designed to be on the go, uh, a device that you use for mobile use. It also is designed to be durable so it can follow you through your life and keep doing its job. Uh, I have here one of the readers and I can pop the battery right off, comes right off the back. You can see all the UL and CE marks that show that we put it through a lot of testing. Um, and also we thought through uh, durability, this is a magnesium chassis on the back which makes it very sturdy and, and resilient. The battery is very simple to engage, you just pop it in like that um, and uh, then uh, the device itself is quite sturdy. Um, we talk about uh, being able to um, uh, carry it with you and use it on a daily basis. One of the things I like to show is this trick. Um, uh, we had user testers who actually did this with the device. Um, so that shows uh, that we thought through uh, an extreme use case, if you will. The Intel Reader uh, ships inside this packaging uh, and it's easy to use, easy to get access to. So you can just sling it over your shoulder. Um, here, let me pop it inside. Uh, you take the reader, you put it inside with that uh, helpful cord outside it like that. Zip it up, and then voila, you've got easy access to the device whenever you need to use it. So you can navigate it, close it up, and you can actually shoot photographs with it inside the case. It's designed so that you get that, uh, you get that camera right at the bottom edge there, the strobe for illumination. Just hold it up like so, put it into shoot mode, and then whenever you want to take a picture, you can by pushing that big blue button.